Today we're going to build a shaker inspired dovetail stool. The stool is going to be 12 inches high, split into two 6 inch risers. It'll have three dovetails, and the noses of the treads are going to be curved with a slight overhang. Let's get started. To begin, I selected my stock. I cross cut the amount required to do both sides. I then jointed one edge. Then scribe seven and a quarter inches down the length of each side. Then using a rip saw, I removed the waste. Keep the off cut as it's going to be the back stretcher later. I then joint the cut edge using the scribed lines to keep the board in parallel. I now divide the board into two 18 inch sections. I begin with one square edge. Then use a knife to mark out 18 inches. I square two knife walls spaced about an eighth of an inch apart to limit tear out. I then cross cut the pieces apart and shoot them square so they're perfect. Before the glue up I make a mark 6 inches up from the end of each board. And this is where the joint will be. To joint these edges I fold the boards away from one another and clamp them in my vise. And with a couple of swipes you should have two continuous shavings coming out where the glue area will be. And when I was satisfied I glued and clamped it up. After the glue cured, I used my number four to smooth out any machine marks and get rid of the glue line. With both faces cleaned up, it was time to split the two sides apart. I make a mark six inches down from what would be the lower step on each side. And square the lines across again with two knife walls to limit tear out. And then with the cross cut saw, I separate the two sides. I then sandwich the two sides together and plane up to the knife lines. Two sides. The stair treads are going to be eight and a half wide by 19 and a half long. Using the exact same methods as I used to prepare the sides, I make the treads.
And here's what you got. Next video, we'll tackle the dovetails.